Driven in the air to right field, back into the corner. Long run back for Bautista. That's going to be over his head. It bangs off the wall. Castro around third. He will come in to score. And in at second base with a first pitch RBI double is Jose Sermo. And the Ducks have answered right back to tie the game up at one apiece. Here comes his 1 2. And DiCarlo pops one up in the air to right towards the line and shallow. Long run for everybody. Bautista can't get there. It's a base hit. Sermo scores. Bautista boots the ball in right. Woodcock coming home. The throw home is way off the line at third base side. DiCarlo at second stops. Thought about going for third. So two run score on the blue pit to right field by Joe DiCarlo. And now Long Island goes in front. They lead it three to one. Here's the 1 0 pitch. And that's hit high in the air to center. Well hit. Back goes Ricardo Cespedes. Has it lined up. Still going back. He'll make the catch. Tagging from third is Romero. He, uh, Mazzilli, he will score. Going to second is Romero. It's a sack flying an RBI off the bat of Carlos Castro. And the Ducks now lead it 5-3. to 2-2. Two -two. And Castro crushes one deep in the air to left field. You can forget it. Into the trees over the left field fence, a two-run home run off the bat of Carlos Castro. It is his 14th home run of the season, and the Long Island Ducks have jumped in front of the Ferry Hawks 7-5 here in the top half of the ninth inning. One ball, two strike pitch coming to Ricardo Cespedes. Kicks and fires, and that hit on the ground is second base. Trevor Achenbaugh field. His throw to first is in time for the out. This ball game is over. Jose Jose picks up his third save of the season, and the Long Island Ducks end their season on a high note as they defeat the Staten Island Ferry Hawks by the final count of 7-5 and earn a split of the inaugural Battle of the Belts.